क्वेश्चन इज गिवन x प्लस वाई इज इक्वल टू ट्वेंटी एक्स वाई इज इक्वल टू फोर्टी फोर सो वी हैव टू फाइंड आउट द वैल्यू ऑफ x एंड y हेयर लेट्स सी सोल्यूशन हाउ वी कैन फाइंड आउट द वैल्यू ऑफ x एंड y x प्लस वाई इज इक्वल टू ट्वेंटी दिस इज इक्वेशन नंबर वन एक्स वाई इज इक्वल टू फोर्टी फोर दिस इज इक्वेशन नंबर टू Now we can write here. This is x plus y equal to twenty. So we can write y is equal to twenty minus x. So here y equal to twenty minus x from equation one. This is the value of y. This is equation number three. Now we have to substitute value of y in equation two. So substitute three in two. Substitute three in two. Then we will get. x y x times y y is twenty minus x twenty minus x is equal to forty four. Now when we are multiplying this term, twenty x minus x times x x square is equal to forty four. Twenty x minus x square minus forty four is equal to zero. When we are multiplying with minus one in this whole term, we will get here x square minus Twenty x plus forty four is equal to zero. Now we got here one equation, so we can write here coefficient of x square that is a equal to one, b equal to minus twenty, and c equal to forty four. Right. So value of x is equal to formula minus b plus minus square root of b square minus four ac upon 2 times a this is formula now we have to substitute value of a b c here so x is equal to minus b b is minus 20 minus 20 plus minus b square minus 20 square minus 4 times a a is 1 times c is 44 divided by 2 times a 2 times a 1 Is equal to now minus minus plus so it will become here twenty plus minus b square so two two is a four here it will become four hundred four hundred minus when we are multiplying forty four with four we will get here one seventy six and this is minus sign so minus one seventy six divided by two is equal to twenty plus minus square root of Four hundred minus one seventy six. Then we will get here two twenty four divided by two. This is equal to twenty plus minus square root of two twenty four divided by two. Now we have to uh, take here factor of two twenty four. So two twenty four. Two one zero two. Two one zero two. Two two zero four. Here it here it will become two five zero ten. Two six zero twelve. Again. So two two is a four two eight is a sixteen, and here two one is a two two four is a eight seven two is a fourteen. Sorry two two seven is a fourteen, and finally seven one is a seven. Right. So here we got the factor of two twenty four is two times two times two times two times two times seven. So we can write this one x is equal to twenty plus minus square root of two twenty four is Two times two is four. Two times two is four. So here it will become four times four times two seven zero fourteen divided by two. Now is equal to twenty plus minus square root of four four zero sixteen times fourteen divided by two is equal to twenty plus minus. Now we can separate this term. So square root of six sixteen times square root of fourteen divided by two. Is equal to twenty plus minus square root of sixteen is four times fourteen divided by two. Now is equal to now we have to separate this term so twenty divided by two plus minus four square root of fourteen divided by two. Now this two is cancelled from here two one zero two and zero equal to ten plus minus two two zero four two square root of Fourteen. So we got the value of x is equal to ten plus minus two square root of fourteen. 
so we can say here value of x1 is equal to 10 plus 10 plus 2 square root of 14 and x2 is equal to 10 minus 10 minus 2 square root of 14 10 minus 2 square root of 14 this is the value of x1 and x2 now we have to find out the value of y1 and y2 so value of y is equal to 20 minus x from equation 3 from equation 3 so we can say value of y1 is equal to 20 minus x1 now is equal to 20 minus now value of x1 x1 is uh, 10 plus 2 square root of 14 so 10 plus 2 square root of 14 is equal to 20 minus 10 plus minus minus 2 square root of 14 so 20 minus 10 it will become here 10 so 10 minus 2 square root of 14 this is the value of y1 now we have to find out the value of y2 now we have to find out the value of y2 so y2 is equal to uh, 10 minus sorry 20 minus 20 minus x2 right so is equal to 20 minus value of x2 value of x2 is 10 minus 2 square root of 14 this is value of x2 so is equal to 20 minus 10 minus minus plus 2 square root of 14 is equal to 20 minus 10 10 plus 2 square root of 14 so value of y2 is equal to 10 plus 2 square root of 14 now we got the value of x1 x2 and y1 y2 so we can say here value of x1 y1 is equal to if x1 is 10 plus 2 square root of 14 at that time value of y1 is 10 minus 2 square root of 14 and x2 y2 is equal to when value of x2 is 10 minus 2 square root of 14 at that time value of y2 is 10 plus 2 square root of 14 so we got the value of x1 y1 and x2 y2 now let's verify this correct or not so let's verify for x1 y1 so question is x plus y is equal to 20 this is first equation given now we have to substitute here x1 y1 so x1 is 10 plus 2 square root of 14 and y1 is 10 minus 2 square root of 14 so 10 plus 2 square root of 14 plus 10 minus 2 square root of 14 question mark 20 right so we can say this one is 10 plus 2 square root of 14 plus 10 minus 2 square root of 14 question mark 20 minus 2 square root of 14 plus 2 square root of 14 it will become cancelled from here so 10 plus 10 is 20 is equal to 20 so we can say here lhs is equal to rhs now next equation is given xy is equal to 44 xy is equal to 44 now we have to substitute here x1 y1 so x1 is 10 plus 2 square root of 14 times 10 minus 2 square root of 14 question mark 44 right now here this is the form of a plus b and a minus b where a is 10 and b is 2 square root of 14 so formula is a uh, a plus b times a minus b it is given here so is equal to a square minus b square now uh, a is 10 so it will become here 10 square minus b square b is 2 times square root of 14 square question mark 44 now 10 square is 100 minus 2 square is 4 times square root of 14 and square so square is cancelled from square root so it will become here 14 question mark 44 now 100 minus 14 for the 56 question mark 44 100 minus 56 10 minus 6 is 4 here 9 minus 5 is 4 is equal to 44 so we can say here lhs is equal to rhs so value of x1 y1 is equal to 10 plus 2 square root of 14 and 10 minus 2 square root of 14 this is correct solution and next one is x2 y2 is equal to 
टेन माइनस टू स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ फोर्टीन एंड टेन प्लस टू स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ फोर्टीन यू कैन ऑल्सो वेरीफाई दिस वन थैंक यू